A truly horrific story tonight with a father now charged with murdering his five-year-old son in DeKalb County. We know for parents this story can be particularly hard to hear and some of the details are simply too graphic for us to share. But it's important for us to tell this story. One of an innocent boy in questions raised about his father's mental state. Here's Chris Hopper. Jennifer, the details are awful. It's impossible to understand. Tonight, DeKalb police are still trying to piece all of this together. This is 25-year-old Montrez Boyd, the father of the five-year-old child DeKalb police say he murdered at this home on Rocky Pine in Lithonia Wednesday night. He had bludgeoned the child to death with a shovel. Police say the story only gets worse. After he did kill the child, he buried the child in the backyard. Police say that's when the boy's mother and grandmother returned home. The grandma's four other children were inside. When the grandmother and the mother arrived back to the house, they told the grandmother that Montrez had killed the five-year-old. The mother uh, discovered that the child was in the backyard and she went back there and, and dug the child up with her bare hands. Police say there are reports Boyd had psychological issues. He and the boy's mother lived in California. Police say they drove into town Tuesday to visit their son. The boy had been living with his grandmother for at least a couple of months. It was just heartbreaking. This neighbor, who did not want to be identified, watched all of it unfold just steps away. She came out the house hollering and screaming, and she was holding something in her hand, which I thought it was a baby she was rocking. Tonight, bikes, kids' toys, and a little bit of police tape are scattered across the yard, a story just too unbelievable to comprehend. And we've just learned that Boyd's first appearance in court will be at 6 o'clock tonight. He's charged with malice murder. And we've also learned that he's been arrested before. The wild details of an incident in Arizona last year tonight at 6.